Dear Rich and Dear DJ Scotty. <clears throat> so, look, the reason why I wanted to do this video is because I wanted to take a few moments sort of just to uh, officially apply to be uh, part of the Just For Fun Radio family, okay? Um, I have four reasons um, that I would like to submit for your for your thoughts, okay? For your, you know, for your consideration, okay? Uh, I believe that if you add me to the Just For Fun Radio family, that I'd be able to bring more content. Um, I've been working on the Matty Lipsis show and other podcasts. I've been working on this stuff for years. So there's a lot of content that I know how to summon so that we've got content. Now, you've already got a lot of content. And so it's not that you have a shortage of content. But one thing that I noticed um, is some of the people that came over from your show to look at mine when I was streaming live, uh, as well as while I was on your show, I loved the comments. And it, it looked like uh, that I bring a different dimension to Just For Fun Radio. And that's what I want to be able to bring. I want to be able to bring a different dimension, uh, not anything to take away from what has already been established, but add to. That's why I like the M's, Morning Mayhem and then Midday Matt, meaning that I'm there to, <clears throat> to sort of like ask questions of people, um, have some, you know, have some engaging dialogue based on what I'm what I'm good at, you know what I'm saying, because I've been listening to talk radio for years. Um, I've been watching uh, talk television for years, political talk. I'm so into it. And some of the topics that uh, that DJ Scotty and, and, and the whole team that you got, Holly and, 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 and Rich, that you guys try to stay away from because you want to have it just for fun. I know how to tackle those topics in a fun way because of whether it's my military background or my church background or my background as a rapper or the fact that I'm engaging in comedy, you know, um, I believe that I can have some real, it'll be really, it'll be content that's, you know, uh, engaging, thought provoking, but also uh, enjoyable to listen to and enjoyable to watch and whatever. So that's number one. I'll be able to bring more content. <clears throat> number two, more reach. Okay, so here's the thing. Everywhere I go, I, I put my CDs in the bathroom of, of, restroom, of uh, restrooms at, at, at truck stops. I talk to people get their information. I There's so much content that I have recorded of me meeting people on the spot saying, look, you did a good thing for me. I'm going to have you on my show right now. And I pull up my phone and I won't stream it. I'll pre-record it because I want to edit it. You know what I'm saying? And stuff like that. So you're going to find um, that I go, every whenever I go places, I always wear my, my outfit. You know what I'm saying? And I go and I, I interact with people. So my intention is, like I said, to put the Just For Fun Radio logo right there so that when they see me, they see, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they'll see my website, but they'll see the Just For Fun Radio and it's in their mind. And when I go somewhere, <clears throat> I like to take a bunch of time to pull over. I'll pull over 20 times in a trip. Why? Pull over, get some gas. Pull over, stop and get something to eat. Pull over and stop uh, and, and use the restroom. Why? Because somebody there, I'm going to meet them. I'm going to have an interaction and I'm going to give them one of my business card flags, which I'll show you when I get there. Get one of my CDs, connect with them, have a moment, a laugh, whatever. And I always turn anything, boom, into something that advertised for the station. So that's my point. I know how to get touch people and what rich was talking about is having a a national audience uh in 2022 i have planned <clears throat> for me to go to california 
and went and, and and be out there for about a week and a half to two weeks. And I always I already have some stuff planned for te- for Texas for later on this year. But my but this when I was thinking is that hey instead of me flying there, let me drive there, right? Um, and then while I'm driving, you know, I'm doing the natural thing that I do. It's you know. Again, I won't, you know, obviously I won't be only driving with Just For Fun Radio in mind, but let's make it work. You know what I'm saying? Because I got to, there's, I'll talk to you more about it, but for the rest of my life, I plan to do a a drive across the country, uh, a tour, doing my music, doing some comedy and stuff like that. And if I take the Just For Fun Radio brand with me, I'm going to reach people and connect them right on the spot. You know what I'm saying? And also, one of the things I've learned to do is I've learned to pre-record stuff, play it like it's live, and then be interacting with people so that I can really engage. Because some comments you miss when you're actively doing the show. But if I'm sitting at home while the show is going, and I'm managing, I'm talking to the different people and connecting them to this and giving them free this or whatever, I know how to do all that stuff, and I enjoy engaging with the audience to give them stuff and to get them connected. Hey, why don't you tell us your story so I can put it on the air? And then I'll talk to those people. You know, while the show is still going, they'll call in and I'll pre-record and talk to them. And then I can add it to the show later. And because I, I'll hopefully will know how I can break in to the broadcast from wherever I'm at. If I'm in Wyoming, California, uh, uh, Illinois, Kentucky, New York, wherever I'm at. I want to be able to grab whatever device I got and then come live and then, you know, be able to stream from where I'm at. I want to be able to do that. So my reach, I want to be able to like, like, in other words, I'm already going to do it. But it's, to me, it'll be wonderful to do it on behalf of Just For Fun Radio so that you guys' reach is more. Because you got to remember, when I was first on your show, uh, uh, um, DJ Scotty, when I went on your show for the first time, one of my own friends that I was in the military with, said, hey, I listen to this show all the time. And it gave me some validation. So my thing is I want to be able to return that back to y'all, okay? So the third thing is uh, more money. With more content and more reach, that's going to translate into money. And um, I learned some stuff related to radio. I learned some stuff about guerrilla marketing and you know, ground marketing and campaigns and stuff like that. So between Rich, DJ Scotty, and me, we can talk, you know, about how to bring more money into the station. And that's what I'm about is to be able to make my employer get, you know, make sure you guys got, as you know, as much money as possible so that you can do the big things that you want to do. And then the final thing is more fun. DJ Scotty, outside of you, who else is more fun? Anyway, thank you so much for watching my little clip. Um, You know, hopefully I'll see you soon and we'll talk later.